Hey, what's up everybody? In this video, we're gonna go over Blur, the NFT marketplace for pros. Also, they have an ongoing airdrop, which is very important because you never know how lucrative that could be for you. And we're gonna go over how you can qualify for that airdrop, which is airdrop two. And if you're lucky, you qualified for airdrop one. And we'll go over that at the end of the video. So let's start with the front, uh, the front page. This is how you can take a look at all of the NFT collections in rank in terms of volume. So you have Board Ape Yacht Club, and you can actually toggle this in two different views. So you can look at it like this. So you can take a look at a lot of different, uh, a lot of more collections at the same time, or you can toggle the view like this, which I personally like taking a look at uh, more so you can see more. Um, and you don't have to scroll too much. So you can also take a look at it from floor price by one day change, seven day change, 15 minute volume, one day volume. So you can take a, you can toggle it by the volume and take a look at what's actually uh, trading the most. So like I said, BAYC, and then you have friendship bracelets trading about 743 Ethereum volume on Blur. And if you're gonna be trading NFTs or just buying NFTs in general, you wanna look at different marketplaces and not only buy on OpenSea because you're probably buying for a small premium where you can get a discount on buying a different uh, on buying on a different platform so you can take a look at one day volume seven day volume different owners by ownership um, so you can see the merge NFT has the most owners and then you can take a look at NFTs by supply as well so that's pretty much the front page you can go ahead and favorite uh, all of your you know NFT collections that you're in that you're eyeing and you can have them in favorites right here so you're not looking through this whole list so I actually really like how Blur is just very clean to use. The platform is clean to use. At the bottom, you have their Discord, their Twitter, you have the price of Ethereum, and then you have the light and night mode right here. So we can go ahead and go to portfolio. This is my one of the wallets, one of my hot wallets. I have 14 NFTs on here, and they do a good job of like getting the spam NFTs out of your portfolio. Like you don't see any here, but OpenSea, I have probably have like 30 NFTs. So they do a good job at that. You also, so we'll start at the start, the wallet up top here. You can see like only listed or show all, all of these are listed. You can see the collections right here, which I only have one collection on this wallet. And then you can see everything up top here. So listed, my estimate value for all these NFTs, my cost, and then the profit, uh, unrealized PL right now, and then my actual realized PL for this wallet, approximately 24, 25 Ethereum. Um, so it's very clean. If we click one of the NFTs, you can see the traits, you can see pretty much everything about it. You have the Ether scan right here, and then the actual different platforms where you can take a look at the same NFT, uh, which is very cool. So if we go ahead and take a look at um, how to actually buy and sell NFTs, they have some cool features. So not only do they have cool features for buying and selling, if I go back to portfolio actually, it's cool because you can list and sell all items at the same time. So you can see um, it's very, um, you can, I can go floor price, put them all at floor price, put them all at the top trade price, and then I could uh, ladder them as well. So I put them all at floor price right now, that's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna relist these, put them all at floor price. Actually, I'm not gonna do that because I have one rare, even though this is a garbage collection, I have one rare and I don't wanna sell that at floor. I almost did that by accident. Um, so we'll go back to the front page, we'll go to collections, we'll click on Board Ape Yacht uh, Club Collection, and then this is how you will see the collection. You have the floor price up top here, the one day floor price, the seven day floor price, the one day change, the seven day change, you have all the volume, owner supply, royalties, and all that great stuff. So you have the amount of NFTs listed right here. And why I like Blur is because it actually shows you, and we'll zoom in right here, marked suspicious on OpenSea. So these are probably under floor right now. They're selling at 60.25 ETH. The last sale was about 37 ETH. It could have got stolen and sold for the highest 
uh, Ethereum offer on OpenSea, or who knows what happened here. So you can actually filter those and not buy those and or if you want a cheap ape and you don't care, then you can go ahead and buy that. You have all the attributes on the left right here. You can go ahead and like go through all the traits, find a rare or look look for the one that you're looking for. You have the option, which I find this is really cool right here, optimize sweep. So you can actually optimize sweep right here. And then it's like you want five NFTs, you want 10 NFTs. And these are, you know, on the more expensive side. So uh, and then you know what's cool about it if you go to the options right here You can skip pending and skip flagged. So if you didn't care about the flagged ones right here um, You could buy all the flagged ones, which I wouldn't recommend doing so you can buy 10 NFTs for about 640 ethereum it's cool because they have the floor depth here as well so you can see how much are listed for and kind of see the the like the sell the sell wall and see how much need to be bought in order for price to go up so it's pretty cool i really like their platform they also have a gas priority here so they have different types of gas presets so if you wanted gas uh, at 50 at 100 at 150 so when you're buying the nfts on the marketplace it'll process at those uh gas um levels and you can be buying uh a lot quicker than using just the standard gas or whatever it may be you also have activity here and you can take a look at these nfts like the collections in a different style if you want as well uh, you can look at them like this, like the open sea style. You can see that they're flagged. You have links to other exchanges to go and look at them. And then you can look at them like this. And uh, that is the marketplace I I icon. So uh, pretty awesome, pretty clean, uh, in my opinion, user interface. It's like really cool to use. And not only that, they have their airdrop coming up. So we can touch on that. We pretty much covered majority of the platform. So airdrop one was the last six months of your NFT volume buying and selling. And then you actually got some care packages. I got lucky, I got 11 uncommon, three rare and one legendary. Airdrop two is coming and that is by listing in November. So coming in November, the more you list, the more you earn. Airdrop two will be much bigger and will be delivered to traders who actively list on Blur. Higher loyalty increase your rarity luck sig significantly. So you can see like the more you list, the more you're trading, the more of an airdrop you're gonna get. And historically, like some of these airdrops have been just massive. So um, I lucked out to have like 50 uh, of these like packages from, from Blur. I'm trying to sell some NFTs, buy and trade some NFTs, list them and just only use Blur to see what kind of uh, airdrop, what, what, what I can yield from this airdrop and hopefully it's large and that's why I made this tutorial to put you guys on and to use Blur because one, they're doing an airdrop, two, the platform's you know pretty dope, it's safe from what I've seen and three, um, you can find cheaper NFTs usually on Blur uh, if you're looking just on like OpenSea or other platforms, check other uh, platforms to get a cheaper rate. Also make sure to put bids so you're not paying market. And that's pretty much it. If you have any questions, post them in the comments. If you have any opportunities, trading opportunities, you know, airdrops, post them below as well. Love to cover them and we'll see you guys in the next video.